something special in the air about UMass? The curiosity idea is what really drives science. You've got to be really curious. You come here to do good science. It really is an incredibly exciting time to be a scientist. When one succeeds, we all succeed. I'm a physician scientist because I absolutely believe that the only way to change clinical care and public health is through scientific discovery. We think that it can predict how cancer behaves in the patient. We don't just have a Nobel Prize winner, an Alaska Prize winner. We have a lot of Howard Hughes fellows. We have a lot of new investigators that's coming from great programs that are excited about joining this. We're in the top 2% of any inst institutions receiving NIH funds. We're still doing very well, so we're really grateful. There's been a real effort over the past several years to mix clinicians, learners, uh, researchers together. It's about discoveries, that if you're a, really a scientist who enjoys discovery, which all scientists do, um, doing it with people from different fields, I think, just makes it that much more exciting and at the same time gives you better answers. The cross-disciplinary conversation is actually where a lot of breakthroughs happen. How do we take the scientific insights and the tremendous talent that we have at UMass Medical School and translate that into the care of our patients to make their lives better? The only way to change clinical care and public health is through scientific discovery and the application of scientific discovery to human health. I'm optimistic about this process because I've lived it. Pediatric HIV infection has been virtually eliminated. Every time we recruit for a new faculty position in molecular medicine, we get about 500 applications from all over the world. And the ingredient that attracts those 500 or more candidates is very, very clear. It's breakthrough science and breakthrough scientists. I think more than anything else, it's the attitude. The science is what matters. You know, the egos don't matter. We have premier programs in diabetes, cardiovascular disease, uh, neurology and stroke, cancer. The Avatar Institute is a, is a great collaboration between the scientists and the clinicians here at UMass. It takes advantage of a, a mouse, a specialized mouse, and this mouse is an extraordinary new model uh, that allows practically any tumor uh, that we have to actually be able to be put in a mouse and to grow just as it does in the patient. It's always been the holy grail to understand how we could turn the body's immune system against these cells. So it's, it's actually huge. It's the discoveries that are the real reward in science. It's not the awards that you get. It's the discovery that you make. And it's that every day, it's that feeling of waking up and being on the frontier. And to know that, that the knowledge that you come back with could make a difference. We will be able to make a tremendous difference, not only in the life of individual patients, but also in the lives of uh, communities around the world. We want to be the best at what we do, and it's, it's really what keeps everybody coming back for more. I'm honored to actually be part of a community like that. In terms of UMass science really impacting the world, it's changed the world, and there's no doubt about that.